Okay, we Blender probably installed now again. Um, let's uh, import the the rifle. So I'm gonna ins uh, import uh, or drag the FBX into the assault rifle folder. And there it is. That's the blend, I think. I'm not sure. So it has the two materials we created. Uh, we can change the colors if we want. Uh, but let's keep it like this. Um, now let's add the weapon to the weapons. To the assault rifle mesh. Uh, let's uh, reset the position. Now you can see the scale is really off, uh, way off. Let's remove the cube first. The, the scale is way way off. I'm not sure what happened, but what went wrong. But um, so if we look at the model, the, the scale factor is uh, one, and here it's like scaled 700 times. So if we scale this one one one, it's really small. But then we killed scale this one seven what is it seven forty uh, no that's even worse than we had so I somehow we we, we or I meshed up the uh, the scale oh yeah it's just one hundred four. So we didn't apply it. Maybe it was a problem with my with my blender. So I'm gonna keep it like this. But um, I usually prefer to get it to get set my scale here, so that it reads one, and my assault rifle also one to have a good uh, size from my 3D modeling software. But it's not really a problem. Um, okay. So let's uh, first align it because it's looking the wrong way. Blue is the z-axis, which is forward, um, and it's looking the wrong way. It rotates really weird too. But oh yeah, there, yeah, it rotates really weird. See, <laughs> strange. But we rotated 180. Um, then we're then we're good. Yeah, we're good. The model is awful, but oh well. I'm gonna put the uh, this one in the download link as well uh, in the description below with the download link and also for uh, the other rifle I did in the first video. It's a little, it's a little bit better. It's not much, but it's a little bit better. All right, with this uh, like so, uh, the mesh at zero. Now let's make sure it it's. Um, where the hand is, because we're gonna when the game starts, we're gonna find the hand and then put the uh, uh, hand, uh, the weapon, set the parents of the weapon to the hand, so it will follow its movement. Um, we could go here and find it, but uh, I prefer to use my weapons uh, transform as a parent and then put them right here and when we ha have one weapon or maybe more weapons when we switch a weapon we move it to the hand parent the hand so it will follow the position but to do so we need to figure out the the position of the uh, of the weapon so let's position it uh, so this uh, that's where the scale of this one is is is, is way off so maybe it has to do with everything. Somehow I screwed it up. Um, I'm gonna keep it like this. I don't feel like fixing it. All right, let's move this 90 degrees, and then probably on the set axis also 90 degrees. Yeah. Now let's put it somewhere here in its hand. Here, maybe here. Okay, yeah, but if I if I would run this, it would go wrong terribly. I will show you because the it will stay right there, and we want it to go to his hand. So what we're gonna do? Um, we're gonna 
right now we are assigning the assault rifle as the weapon for the uh, player shoot. Um, so let's open a player shoot. And um, player shoot, or maybe play a weapon. I'm not entirely sure. Let's open up uh, assault rifle. No, we're not going to do it here. So let's move to the shared. Let's do the shooter. Well, yeah, we're going to use the uh, shooter, so we don't have to do it for every weapon. Um, so let's first find the parent transform. So let's say a public transform uh, hand. Well, let's not make it public, we'll just make it serializable. Serialize field uh, transform hand. Um, we're gonna undo this mu muzzle, it doesn't need to be public. So let's make it private and move it to the privates down here. Down here. Okay. So this is my hand. Uh, we're gonna probably change this later on when we are refactoring it so in when we are in the awake we're gonna say uh, let's see hmm let me let me just find a good position for where we want to place this uh, not in the player not in the, of course not here player shoot uh, maybe we could do the player shoot right here so also we can uh, add more weapons later or would a shooter be the better place well just let's stop wasting your time and, and do it uh, here let's do it in the player shoot so we're gonna set the parent. Uh, we have the assault rifle as a shooter. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm not really sure what I'm doing right now. Let's let's calm down, take a good look. What I'm trying to do, I want to put the assault rifle in the hand of the player. So we can set it as a parent. So uh, this is the body, spine, spine, uh, right shoulder, right arm, right forearm, right hand. Like so. So this is set from the uh, weapon. Now we're just gonna say this is this is not how we're gonna do it eventually. Um, set uh, transform. Set parent hand. Right. So now it it moves to the hand. Uh, so if you can if you look at the at the right hand, now the assault rifle has moved here. And it, it's gone from the weapons. Uh, but you see the rotation is still not the way we want it. Let's check how it looks. We need to rotate it a little bit on the uh, on the Z -axis. Uh, wait. Uh, yeah, maybe on the Y. On the Y axis. And we're gonna move a little bit lower. So that's just, this is about what we what we want, and maybe a little bit on the z axis back to so something like this. So let's undo it. Come back to the weapon. OK. 
Okay, so uh, it was a little bit forward, a little bit inward, and a little bit lower. How's this? We still need a little bit more on the rotation forward. So the Y axis. Even more. So this is just tweaking your, your weapon weapons position even more. Okay, this looks much better. Uh, still, we want it to be a little bit more inward on the z-axis, or not. Let's check it one more time. Because it's it's a uh, it's in his hand here, in his arm. And how is his hand in the front? We have to work with this model's position, so... Uh, I think this is... Let's see how it looks from the game. You can see it's, it looks pretty pretty good from here, because you cannot really... Uh, you cannot really see it. Cool bullets. <laughs> okay. Well, that uh, that works. We're gonna keep it uh, <coughs> keep it like this. Tweak it all the way you want, uh, but you get the idea. Um, see you in the next video. Bye bye.